My name is R.C. Concepcion and I'm a photographer, author, and digital post-production specialist at a university here in the Northeast. I've spent over 20 years making images and have loved to been able to tell my stories through pictures. A couple of years ago, the industry landscape shifted more into the world of video. Today, it seems not enough to tell your story through an image. With the advent of social media, we're more responsible in getting the complete story through video to make an even deeper connection to the projects that we take on. As a photographer, I wondered how much of the skills that I currently had would transition into the world of video and I jumped in headfirst to get a pair of Canon C100s to do just that. A couple years later, I can say that these cameras have been responsible for letting me tell stories big and small, allowing me to stay competitive in the creative space. You see, not every job is going to be the next major motion picture or the next incredible documentary, but there are plenty of small to medium businesses that would want their story told. Every city has a local company that's trying to get their products on Facebook or a nonprofit trying to showcase why they do what they do. The shoots that I work on are usually composed of a one to three person crew and two cameras. Most times, I'll be honest, I tend to wear all of the hats on the shoot. For lenses, I tend to rely on the 24 to 72.8 or the 24 to 105 f4. For tighter shots, I focus on using a 70 to 200 28. For smaller work like this, I think it's a good idea for me to keep the amount of gear small and the crew light so that I can kind of get in and get out. While I certainly have the ability to do the grading of my footage, I like that I can leverage Canon's color presets in this space to let me get the look that I want quickly. Another thing that's been super helpful has been the built-in ND filters on the C100s. If we were shooting outdoors and we were trying to shoot at a wide f-stop, having the option of multiple ND filters right inside of the camera make it super easy. Now, while we're talking about ease, the ease of use of the camera took the learning curve of using a new device and made it easier for me, allowing me to focus on developing the story. That's the most important part. As I started doing this and I started exploring the world more, I noticed that my skills as a photographer did help produce videos a lot faster than I thought. As I generated more content, my needs increased and I had to set up a studio to help with not only my video production, but all my photographic projects as well. So video kind of helped me grow even further. I'm grateful for the realization that as a creative, I can make a living by telling the story of so many different people and so many different jobs of shapes and sizes. I can focus my business in my own neighborhoods and help them share their stories. I can use those jobs as a springboard to work for bigger clients or bigger personal projects for myself. It puts fuel in the tank to get you to the next one. Now, am I still looking for the million dollar project? Of course I am. But I can do so thriving creatively, helping locally and exploring my vision even further and I can't ask for any more than that.